Hello there, everyone, and welcome back to Victoria to your host, Mr. Espana level. All right, now, wow, Austria Hungary, you are, you are sucking a fat one right now. Holy crap, you have a score of eight, a score of one. You're a secondary power. Oh, the Dutch are over here. Two, two, two? what the? Anyways, um, hope you guys are having a pretty good day. I've uh, got some comments to go through, and. Uh, it's not looking very good for Austria-Hungary, I would say. But, regardless, we're at war with America now, because uh, we want to make sure we get Colombia as a puppet. So, yeah, we'll see what we can do. And apparently, Germany and the Confederates are still at war with the, seven, with the Japanese. Huh. Second Romanian liberation of Del Erdeli, the Tonkin Campaign, and the War of Jalan Gambia Concession. Okay, then. But uh, America's got quite a few divisions here, and also we just—I just wanted Colombia, so we're doing well against Colombia, so there's no issue with that, hopefully. But still, uh, America's here, but we do have our allies, so uh, Ecuador. It's fine, whatever. Uh, Confederate. Oh, hello. Oh, nice. So, and there was one of the comments saying we should create a colony in Africa. Nice. Actually, where's the colonial map mode for this? Oh, Annex Vietnam. Well, that sucks. What are you guys? Uh, vol colonial map mode. Ooh. Oh, we're out of points now. Well, god dang it. Well, that's all the points we got. We get Desert Africa. Nice. Go straight for Bogota. If we can get that fast enough, we probably won't have too many issues trying to fight the Americans, but you never know. Women's suffrage, huh? Well, going to war with these guys. Benjamin, Arthur, North Platte. I mean, it's only North... Oh, I guess Nebraska still. What is this? Uh-oh. Italian liberation of Lombardy against the Russian Empire, the Kingdom of Italy, and Monaco. I should play as Italy. I don't think I've ever played as Italy, Italy yet, so... Oh, boy. And, and this is HFM, so everything's going to be pretty railroady. That's very blue, which is not terrible, but still. Oh, hello. Actually, do we have a lot of... Well, I've got some army down there, too. We should go to war with China again to get some more money. When's the next time we can go to war with them? Oh. Anytime. Nice. Well, these guys will be killed off and immediately. Japan was <clears throat> a pain in the butt when trying to take out Korea, but it is what it is. Oh, they have no score. But then again, Japan might just go to war with us anyways because it can. It's the garbage. Of course, like normal, we need a bigger military, but what else is new? Ooh, they're taking out Venezuela like crazy. Um... I don't know how good our army really is compared to them, so... Uh, look at what we need. We'll need America for this. Ooh, steam and we're trying to get more. Ooh, that's, that's good, too. Manifest Destiny, I love that one. Oh! Well, our army's being completely crushed right now. Should have paid a little bit more attention to that. We lost a complete army. Well, crap, that's not good. Well, yeah, I might have to fix that a little bit later on. Um, that's really not good. And then we came back down, huh? Factory costs? I mean, in the, in the meantime, I, we might eventually just, like... Ooh. Sure, why not? Um, like, I might replay this off-screen. We'll see. No guarantees. Yeah, the base. All I care about is getting Columbia, though. We have to get Colombia. All right. We actually asked Germany to join the war. Oh, they already are at war. I guess we'll see. Can you guys come to the war too? No. Ah, we're not the leaders of this war. Yeah, America's still pretty darn strong, so we'll see. Not a good idea to try to attack them. Especially if they're mountains. Actually, are, are you. Well. Just technically, yeah. Congolese influence. A group of Spanish entrepreneurs recently spent time playing Congolese officials and fine wine affairs at a formal affair in Congo's litigation quarter. The result is promising. <clears throat> a number of new business ventures and trade deals given the kingdom of Spain created a sway over the Congolese affairs. All these have been acquired as a government support. Uh, sure. We're not making any money, anyways, but that's alright. Sorry, no way back. Oh my goodness. This is why America's gotta be destroyed. Wow. Pretty bad. Oh, wait, what happened? Did anything happen here? 
Wait, did you lose? Miss did you get Did they lose Missouri? Maybe they never got it. Oh, it's HFM, what do you expect? But still. Um yeah, I'll go there. Oh, hello. Why not? There you go. Yes. Uh, maybe we should have given it to our puppets. I hope we can give it to our puppets. I don't want to own all this territory, but it's probably bugged. Who knows Patagonia? But still. What is culture? Patagonia and Pla Platean. Alright. Anything else around here? No. Alright. Sorry, Poppet, but we'll see what happens. French Opium War. Futa Jalon, excuse me, Sailor. A dispatch has arrived from her attaché in Futa Jalon. Detail of the tragedy of a sailor and a merchant marine. Apparently, the sailor killed a local in the scuffle during an extended shore leave in any province. Despite press from a diplomatic mission, he was later tried and executed according to Jalon laws. While more is passing, we should also take time to consider what we should do about this grave and serious insult to national honor. I'll take that, yeah. Yeah, like I said in the previous episode, it's just so hard playing as Spain, because you don't have the population for anything. This looks really bad, actually, too. Where are the Germans? Why are they not helping us out? Ooh. Nice. Very nice. Um... Is that it? Well, we colonized a good chunk of Africa. It doesn't mean it's worthwhile at all, but, you know. Nice. The score is probably getting worse for us, but whatever. There's that fleet. There's that fleet. This fleet. You guys are just hanging out here. Um, We just don't have that many armies at all. These guys will finish these guys off down here. We're going to have to find a way to make sure we can actually win down here. Or really find the mountains, probably. That's probably my only, our only hope, really. Oh my goodness. Italy's not doing well, well at all against France and the other groups. Oh, we're good, man. Oh god, is China War someone else too? Oh, French Sino War. Indo China acquire all states and core provinces. What is this? Oh, some guys released? Oh, wow, we actually got up here already? Nice. If you just stay there, in theory, uh, and you got a lot of defense, you should never lose. No matter how many men they throw. Oh, well, maybe not. Never mind, we're gonna lose. Why are we losing so badly? Because you're good on attack and nothing else. Holy crap, our soldiers suck so hard. Yeah, I'm going to have to redo this off screen just a little bit because it's not looking too good. Japan, you, you you screwed us over earlier, so no. Yeah, this is really bad. Um, America's so just ridiculously strong. Mm, lose one more exhaustion, that'd be fine. Yeah, we got, we're getting whipped here pretty darn hard. You think if you go on defense in mountains, you'd be okay, but apparently not. You got more research points, which is good. Uh, J6 maybe? Maybe not? Maybe. It's fine. Oh, wait, what? Oh. Columbia. Okay. Oh, can we have a... Oh. I don't think getting doing any of that would be smart, so... Alright, well, that really butchered the crap out of uh, the Spanish Nueva España. That was actually really, 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 really bad. Um, so I'm going to spend some time on screen just kind of repairing ourselves, but... At the same time, let's go ahead and, uh, the Vice Royalty of New Granada. The territories of the Vice Royalty of New Granada gained de facto independence from Spain between 1819 and 1822 after a series of military and political struggles, uniting in a short-lived republic now known as Gran Colombia. 
Earlier, you know, under a control which you read and find the breakaway states of a stronger single colony. Bosch Fueros. The relentless centralization or centralizing drive of the Spanish crown led after the end of the First Carlos War to the reduction of the Basque industrial or institutional and legal system called Fueros, but it was only after the last Carlos War that it was virtually wiped out. After the war, a new Spanish constitution was drawn up in order to establish unitarian and central administration in Spain, cut out according to a Spanish Castilian pattern. Navarre was effective, but for the moment it was spared from further curtailments due to the 1841 Compromise Act. They turned officially the semi autonomous Kingdom of Navarre into yet another province of Spain. The Basques were forced to enroll in the Spanish military in on an individual basis, and not in separate groups or corps, despite the fact that many Basques could hardly articulate a pair of phrases in Spanish, exposing them at best to stressful experiences. These changes allowed Spain to turn into a modern, unified country, shaking off last bits of the ancient regime, the first step to end the originalism uh, driving the forces behind the Carlos and the Cristinos. Huh. Okay, that's kind of cool. Quarter, nice. And anything else here? The Mycenaean excavations. Um, oh, we need a sphere of Greece then, maybe. International African Association. We need a couple more stuff. Philippine stuff. Of course, Asian farms and stuff. Uh, we need social science. And then Baghdad, owner influencer. Annex reserve. So, uh, it's not a subject nation. Okay. Well, we'll see what happens as we're going to try to make ourselves just a little bit stronger. Oh, look at this. This is so beautiful. I love this color. It's so nice. Look at that. Nueva Granada. Let's ally them. And have a good old time with South America, because I do want to puppet, eventually, the Empire of Brazil. And here we are at, everyone, February 24th, 1884, in which, you know what, let's probably let, let one more month go before we actually go to war with the Chinese. But, unfortunately, we did get an event saying that, for us, uh, we did get Basque and Catalan as removed as accepted cultures, which, uh, is not great, but it is what it is. Now, maybe we shouldn't go to do war to do it like this, but we'll see what happens. Um, these guys actually might get really destroyed here, but whatever. Belgium? Some good old Belgium boys? Belgium! Increased relations. All right, so you, oh, you guys are looking really bad there, actually. Uh, see what you can do. Our ship's looking pretty darn bad. Let's get the guys over there first. And, in all honesty, we probably should probably get repair you guys too, but we'll see what, we'll see what happens. Wow. Oh, these guys are all fighting down here, too. That's right. Oh, and our guys are probably just immediately all destroyed there. Whoa. We're losing population. Whoa. Krakatoa explodes. Kaboom. Actually, are we... 42% for the Argonata. Okay, we're not getting any things here. Um, well, that's not good. Why are we not getting any more supply? Artillery and Clipper Convoys, huh? Well, you all best be going to China now. Do the best you can. Mao Ming. Why not? Our military should be slightly better than it was before. Mechanized mining is very good to get. Colonial policy debated. Conservative or liberal. I do want more prestige. Um, oh, but where are we at? So, 40%. 40%. Uh, probably go conservative just because of that extra prestige. We can always use more prestige. And we are butchering them. Nice. Zhao Qing. Nice. Education efficiency is good. Social science for even more prestige and such, stuff like that. Uh, let's go with industry with more railroads. And then maybe we get electricity. We gotta continually improve our military too, but uh, we'll get there. Pingle. Ping, 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 pingle. Colon discontent. Nope. You're not bad on attack. Uh, let's get there first. Now, if you both came in and did that, what would happen? We're slaughtering thousands of them. <clears throat> Not bad. Maybe I'll came over here. Going to migrations, state capitalism. We love state capitalism. Okay, now I'm getting more supplies. Good. Um, just don't want to exhaust our soldiers here. More organizations, nice. <clears throat> Excuse me. Fight for a country. And more Belgium? Yes. We love the Belgiums. Nice. More score. Can we actually peace out with you yet? No. We're getting closer, though. Works smart. Can we actually win here? Ooh. 
We're losing quite a few guys ourselves. We gotta be careful about how many guys we actually do have. Ooh, can you actually win there by yourself? You should be able to, maybe. Yeah. There you go, nice. Give him a couple months, give him some more guys. Some more guys. More stuff like that. Uh, you guys looking okay ish. Give him one more month to heal up and whatnot. Take that too. Ooh, conservatives, nice. Yes, 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 yes. Finally, we can spend more money here. I'm taxing the crap out of poor people in the middle class. There we go. Give him another month. <clears throat> Hopefully, he can do a little more of this. I do that too. Alaska? Very nice. Yay! Alaska is more fully colonized for us. Very nice. I guess they're still fighting the Germans. And actually, now the Confederate States are a great power too. Very odd, yes. I know, very odd. Okay, quite a few Spanish speakers in Cuba. At least little Spanish culture people. So, very odd. I was trying to build up a big old army here too. We have, hey, we have two, so we need two more parties. Actually, how many clerks do we actually have here? Clerks, 2%, it's not bad. How are we looking here? Oh my gosh! Romania! Austria Hungary is here, but they don't have the Hungarian part of Hungary! Oh my goodness. Bukovina? Holy smokes! Oh, that's really quite green. Oh, Kashmir, that makes sense, I guess. We'll give some time. Um, Gabu, sure, it's fine for now. Population is what? 41 million. 41 and a half is not bad. Um, I just dig deep and greedily. Uh, we don't want too much militancy. That's after that one, steel railroads, go electricity. Are we going to need more population growth? We could try this. Place in the sun. Cool. Our nation is one of the most prestigious po great powers on earth. From Madrid to far flung, flung, far flung provinces abroad or beyond, our flag flutters proudly in the winds, striking fear into the hearts of anyone who dares oppose us. In celebration of our dominance and just reign, an imperial parade is being planned in Madrid. The question now, now poses itself should we invite foreign dignitaries to this joyous occasion? We shall simply conclude that no other nation is fit to bask us in our place in the sun. That's a lot more prestige. I love that. Belgium. Good, good, good. No. Nice. Or you're literally just gonna die here. Because you literally have nowhere else to go, right? I guess you have to do Mount Ming still. Well, that's war exhaustion, that's good. So many enemies. Busan, we can intervene eventually. We can peace out with these guys. They would accept that. Can we add anything else? Honestly, we might as well add something else. Can we actually, like, liberate people, huh? Then we could look really ugly. Release puppet? Eh, cut down to size. That's a lot of infamy. Humiliate? Get a little more prestige. Dismantle fortifications. What about reparations? That's not bad. But that's t ooh, 20 score. Oh, it just be a good, good, good piece now. It's fine. Nice. Oh, organize Mauritania. We should organize the African colonies to better reflect both the local structure as well as set up the possibility for autonomous rule, dominated by benevolent colonial administrators, of course. Nice. And then what else do we have? Anything else here? The Jiang uh, something treaty port. The Ji Jiajing treaty port. Xiangjing is well known for the hometown of silk, and is a famous producer of textiles and woolens. While not being as important as neighboring Shanghai, its acquisition would truly help our textile industry. Nice, not bad. Both of you go there, and one of you guys just dock, and... Hey, welcome aboard, Xiangjing. Xiangjing. I can build that army back up. It's fine. Okay, not bad. Now we've got to figure out what we're going to do next, in which we'll probably... Probably... Going to really start expanding further down south here, maybe? And maybe start taking some lands? Oh, we did make up two divisions here. Two two things here. 
infantry and whatnot. Ooh, we can build some roads here too. Not a bad idea. Well, everyone, I didn't realize it, but apparently I forgot about the whole scramble for Africa thing. So we're going to go to War Dendi and see what we can do. Um, there's just a few divisions here. There ain't very many divisions, but we'll see what we can uh, be cooking up here and just see if we have any good times. I can also expand some railroads down here as well. Nyami? Can't get there fast enough? Oh, yes we can. Oh, good. Nice. And they're going to go to Doso? Sure. Because this guy's really good on attack, so... A little bit less organization, but that's not really a big deal at all. Um, should have this under our control. Uh, oh, acquisition of British Gabu, huh? Oh, it's going to take forever to get... Oh, boy. I mean, it's not that far off from when we were at war with the Chinese, so... Let one of these guys go first. Uh, expand the areas that need to be expanded. And do that too. More railroads. I'll try to build railroads up in uh, our allies as well. Cool. There we go. Nice. More capitalists, please. Oh, the French are still fighting down here. Seems like the French are always fighting down there. Uh, with you, I'll probably just dump you back up over there. And Belgium again. Hello, Belgium. Cool. How we doing? Doing all right? Looking pretty good. Nice. Yeah, we have like almost no infamy, which is pretty nuts. Not gonna lie, that's pretty darn nuts. So keep expanding. More industry. I'm building up anyways, because you can. Oh, and we have tensions to spit. That's good. Good, 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 good. Now we're making some serious money from China. I love it. Nope. Oh boy, Terra sells. Wow, well, that's probably not very good. Even though we're not gonna make a lot of money just because we've spent all that even more money or taxing people less, that should make people slightly better. Wow, and for consciousness is because war is going down, huh? Temperance League. I don't think we can annex them yet, say. Oh, well, now they'll accept it. Alright then. Well, since we're here, anyways, put some roads up. Probably use some artillery, right? And maybe an engineer. Give him some time. Build themselves up. Ah, eh, get some of that too, because you can. Make it really difficult to annex like these, or take these bases over. Also, we want to make sure. Oh, that O'Donnell's de having O'Donnell dead is not a good idea. But that uh, we really keep building up a lot of uh, roads around here, especially in our allies. Make sure that they're really strong. And by allies, I mean satellites. Cool. It's going to cost a lot of money, but you know what? I think it's worth it in the end. Cool. Cool. And... Oh, railroads. Yes, sir. Cool. We need to take time to do this. we got to make sure that all these areas do really, really well. Their success is our success. Oh, Germany's there. Look at that. Costs a lot of money, but that's okay. There's a place around here that were devastated by the war with America. Oh, boy. Tucson. El Paseo. Now, hopefully, with the Confederates taking so long to get strong, that they eventually will be able to beat America up by themselves. So then we can just take out the Confederates by themselves. That's my hope. Doesn't mean it's going to happen, but... Like I said, it's my hope. Um, anything else around here? Uh, not too much. Nothing that's really ours, ours. So, Mongolia's not quite ours yet, at the very least. Cool. Let's get some electricity. 
Uh, increase relations with pretty much all the other foreign powers. Get more Belgian boys, even though it would probably waste some time doing Belgium, to be honest with you. Cool. Supply line's nice. Just so nice. Factory cost. Yes, please. Supply limit, nice. Cool. Uh, sure. You know what? Oh, we'll allow that this time around. Oh, the Ottomans, you know. Oh. War of Spanish control over Colombia is still going on. Okay, then. Confederates, it's fine. Kingdom of Italia, it's fine. Russian Empire. Andorra, you guys. UK. Oh, oh, wow. Darwinism, plus 50% more education efficiency. Very nice. Give it a month or so. Wow, we're fourth in the world for military power. How? Is it just people killing each other so harshly? Probably. Nice. There you go. Can we actually go to war with these guys? Oh, yes, we can. But they're all allies with that guy. Bambada? All right. Population-wise, there are way more people here. Segu. So we want Eastern Mali. Oh, discontent. Nice. Just drastically, hopefully, going to increase that. This is unemployment. I've been around all workplaces in the city, but I just can't seem to get a break, sir. I wonder what to do. I cannot go home and let the grass grow around my feet all day. My family trusts me to support them, but what should a poor sod do when there are no jobs available? With jobs, scares and creators meet intensely, inversely plentiful. Many from the poor class are having trouble making ends meet. Oopsie. You don't want the eastern ones. Get, can script some natives to fight for us, right? That's my favorite thing. Ah, the natives. Oh, hello. Nice. We have a lot of prestige. Good amount of industry. Military score is pretty good. We're just burning through a lot of money, that's all. Helps we don't have to tax our own middle class. Clerics are what percent of the population? Not bad. Plurality. Nice. Very good. And they'll probably go to War Thimbuck too and all them. Come on, Sicasso. Oh, yeah, why not? Works with us. Nice. Um, that. I'm not sure why we can make guard units. We'll make two of them. Uh, I'll make three, three things of that. That's fine. Watara? Alright, we'll go straight for Watara. Uh, let's, let's at least finish up Western Mali. That'd be nice. Go straight to war. And more research. Assembly line? You know what? Screw it. We're gonna become an industrial juggernaut here. Nice. I need to call. Oh, we need we need more warships too. I forgot. I, I want to say more more ships, more dockyards and stuff like that, but I keep forgetting. I just hope there's no like scripted colonization event. That would severely limit us in terms of what we can uh, colonize and if we have to get colonies. Also, Belgium did get the Congo. So, there are people no longer going to have hands down here. So. Oh. Oh, yeah. These guys are actually doing that. Yes, yeah, fine. It's fine. Okay. Whatever. Nice. Timbuktu, no score, no score. Ah, oh, they got eight score. Ah, the British are here too. The homie. Put the alone, huh? Man, lots and lots of cost here. Electric gear factories, nice. Just want to give our guys the best quality of life possible currently. And we'll probably take Timbuk 2 or Timbuk 2. Um, not really sure. Nothing not really matters much. There's a lot of slaves here, though. It's fine. Of the cradle. God dang it, that sucks.
Oh wow, we can make way more of a population up here. Two more infantry, so if you're not an accepted culture, we want to kill you off probably. Catalan. Catalan. Uh, first 60,000 sack is very good to have. We're still allied with the Germans, which is great. The French are still war with the Chinese, which is weird, but we'll take it. And the Italians dropped out of great power status. Okay, wow. Dutch are a great power. All right, so be it. Here comes the homie. Telephone lines, not bad. Who you to spare for? Why not? That's fine. I'm gonna award Mosi. Timbuktu, why not? We could take more territory there, but whatever. I, I want the territory that we already have, so. I'll go with cannons. Chamber of Commerce protests. If you want to hear about that, please go right ahead. Anti Colonial League. Ignore the League. Socialist. Then announce the League. We have literally no infamy right now. That is insane. Excuse me, my good sir. Please die for amusement. Let's kill them off and then demand to book two. I love it. More infantry. Do we actually have horses here yet? Yeah, we do. I think so. All right, that's. I love my African adventures. Africa is such a fun place to be unless you're African. Oh, what's this? Oh, okay, that's Mali. We should organize African colonies to better reflect both the local structure as well as set up the possibility for an autonomous rule dominated by our benevolent colonial administrators, of course. Nice. Very nice. We haven't really had almost any reforms at all, which does kind of suck, but at the same time, is there anyone else we can beat up? Oh. Do we have a truce with them? Yeah, I don't want to break that. 1888. That's not bad. Oh, the Sultan over here. Oh, no, we can't do that one. How's, uh, Hungary is still isn't pretty badly. Okay. Morocco. Protectorate. Not a bad idea. All right, everybody. So, time for a little bit of Moroccan love. Yeah, Operation Moroccan Love. That's what we'll call it. Moroccan love. Love Morocco. Love Morocco. We got a bigger naval base now. I like big bases, I cannot lie. The bigger the bases, the, the bigger the happiness. Totally. Totally. Uh, sorry, expanding that. More, we're building up more, mil more army bases, or at least getting more forts, even though they don't really matter too much. Um, I don't have a new base up here anyway, so that's not good. We need more money. I might start taxing the middle class. We'll see. 67%. That's not bad. Got some of that there, too. Um, Hav Havana. Not bad. Puerto Rico. Not bad. Actually, how about here in uh, this place? Where are the ports here? Anywhere? Naval base size. Where's the naval base? Um, no. Yeah, we'll see. Let's see. Down here as well. Cool. And. Cool. French doing their whole Frenchy thing. Koreans. Alrighty toddy. Yeah, we're gonna need way more money than this. Uh, we honestly probably don't need to spend that much money on the military for now. Conservative, liberal, 36% upper house in favor of reform. Up to five, there's no guarantee. We probably still get any reforms. Oh, it was so close. Every day's needs met. Let's see. Can we get a little more money every single day? That could be very beneficial. We just need a war chest, really. Ooh, even more population growth. Oh, sign us up, man. Nice. What about? Third liberation of Anisian. And still fighting the British down here for these guys, too, so. What about, though? West Africa is not looking too bad. Nice. Very nice. And we'll take 
Fez. A couple more dollar dues. Oh. I forgot we even owned this part too. Huh. Oh. Not bad. What's on? Cool. Hrubka? Hrubka. Losing a lot of guys to attrition here. My goodness. It's fine. Belgium. Actually, can we just go back to war with these guys too? Must he? Yeah, we don't truce with them, so. Thanks, guys. We appreciate it. I love going for Africa. Now that's just straight up beautiful. Head on back up to the uh, capital ish area. It's just here in Casablanca. See that. Bing bong boom. Nice. We do own Ifnia, if we keep forgetting that. Beautiful, my friends. Mayday Parade, if you remember that, please go right ahead. Uh, support this fine display of international solidarity between workers. How's militancy doing? Well, let's do that one. We'll actually go down. No, god dang it. Whoopsie. Oh well. Yeah, I gotta wait till another month, that's fine. Good, good, good. Yes, good, good, good. Uh, probably more army stuff would be really nice and decent to get as well, but I want more industry. High pressure steam engine. Should be able to get that one done pretty darn quickly. Nice. I love Africa. So, what do we have in this army? 5, 3, and 1. We need more artillery support. Very good. Good to because we can. We got so many slaves here. Huh, this is mental construction of Oh god. The war's already over, huh? Oh, they're actually. Oh, the Italians are allied with Germany. Where have I seen that one before? Huh. But they war with the Japanese, so I might actually have to make sure that that's okay. Uh, let's see. Organize the upper volta. Yes. Same, same sort of reading, nice. Religion changes as a Catholic, as they should. Airplanes, very nice. Goodbye. And die. Oopsie. Ivory Coast, huh? I'll go for that small one first, that's fine. The French sign of Indian War. Well, French sign of Indian, no. Uh, 104. Oh. Well, they're doing really well against them. The French aren't doing so well. Hey, conservatives won again. Nice. You know, I want more liberal support. In general. Oh, the Dutch took these guys out. God dang it. Stupid Dutch. You dumb Dutch Renodes. <laughs> New store in Soria. Very good. Where are we losing to homie? Oh. Oh, we have no more colonial points. That sucks. Compound steam engine. Hot blasts. Steel railroads. Go that one. Oh, we're out of money too. Oh crap. Well. Fine, let's drop them then. They'll get that. Which means they'll be bogged down there too. Hey. You know, we're trying the best we can. Oh, they're aboard these guys too. Uh, How's the land? Can we get How's the land? Yeah. We'll take it as soon as we possibly can. As fast as we possibly can. Let us at least take it. Hope this will all be worthwhile in the end. Oh, well, we got the capital. Take the 
over. Nice. Enough to yet? No. Dang it. Kata Katsina? There we go. There we go. That's looking pretty darn nice. Go to infantry, railroads, get some of that. Get some of that as well. Do we have horses? Yeah, we do. Nice. We have more here too. Nice. And artillery. Are you guys stuck down here? Why should we just go up through them? If possible, yes. Be very nice. And the Ottoman Empire? Why not? Good. Go home. I think we did really well here. Marrakesh, Maghreb, Berber, Maghreb. We're seventh in the world for industry. That's actually really. That's a lot better than I thought we would be at. Cool. Nice. Awesome. How's the lands? Got enough funds? Hopefully, you guys have enough funds. 70% of our population is literate. Our average literacy is not terrible either. Is there anywhere else we could do that to? Also, why does Denmark have Tunis and. Tripoli. What the heck? Um, Yugoslavia did form too. God, there's, the UK needs to be taken down a notch. Oh my goodness, look how bad that is. Holy smokes. Holy, holy fathers. But we'll see what happens. Ah, uh, yes. Back to Korea, which actually right now we're sixth place in the world, we're fourth in the prestige, which is awesome. We have, we're seventh in the industry and eighth in the military status, but other than that, hopefully we will do this war pretty nicely. But we do need to, uh, <clears throat> we'll go back to war with China. We need some more money. And China's a good place for money. Lots of money. I like money. Money's pretty good to have. But, and like normal, Belgian boys. <sighs> Nothing like a good Belgian boy. Just ask Taki Senpai. Well, that's not good. Chile? Nah, it's got the capital, which is very good. Hopefully Japan does not join this war at any time. And maybe get some more, more reformers by the end of this video. Oh, cool. Good job. Good job, Portugal. Um, I'll be honest. At this point, I might just like demand money, just just because. Oh, also, because we're doing Gabon. Very nice. Uh, I can't do that one. The Congo, man. Oh, oh nice. Oh, annex. Cool. But yeah, we're looking pretty good right there, aren't we? Oops, my bad. Nice. Very good. Very good. Very good. Oh, we don't have a lot of money though. Also. Austria is dead. Apparently, G Germany was like, no, nah, no more Austrians. We're just going to annex all of Austria-Hungary and leave out the Hungarian part of it. Which I've actually never seen before. Oh, we have seven here. This score is 43. Ooh. Romania. This just looks, this looks worse every single time we see this. Romania is just blobbing into Hungary. The Bohemian Moravia is a socialist puppet or satellite of Germany, which looks disgusting. I hate this so much. Bohemian Schlesing? Uh, why? Just give this to them. Why? And then, uh, of course, we have Galicia Ludomeria, which... I don't even know, man. I don't even know. Um, so... I mean, I don't mind Germany getting big. Also, they have San Marco, Republic of San Marco, with a sphere, but... Wasn't given to Italy. And these guys are so big, so... I, I don't... I, I don't understand. Nice job, nice job. You guys come down here and keep going down south. Actually, how much can we do if we wanted to annex and get a war goal? Propose peace. We're not there yet, but we're getting there. We're working on it. Plus, it's unemployed. Uh, get some local support. Why not? Very good, very good. Union busting. Um, become more reactionary, less socialist. Uh, you know what? I don't mind maybe them becoming slightly more socialist, maybe we'll get more upper house support. Mines commission in 1892. Rush through reforms. Um, some limited safety regulations, we really want that. Minimum wage. Ooh. Factory cost goes up quite a bit, but more maintenance, more immigrant attraction. Eh, regulations. Uh, pension level goes up. Uh, we'll do that one. Cool, guys. Pyongyang? Sounds good to us, but now we have a big old border with the Chinese, which is not necessarily a good thing. Um, you guys... 
All right, you guys definitely need work, and you guys need work over here too. So, oh, and we now have this too. Warship, Asian farms and mines. If you want to read about that, please go right ahead. If you want to read about the African farms and mines, please go ahead as well. And then we have organized Gabon. Yes, yes, very good. And a formerly local government as well. Claims in the Muni River. Well, with historical rights to the Bight of Biafar, Biafra, other colonial powers are demonstrating a growing interest in the area. The principles of effective occupation means we can lose this whole area, but we're going to try to strike a deal with another colonizing country to secure a strip of land in Bata. Oh, they lose 0.99 literacy. Nice. Muni River. Huh. Where is that? Ah! Oh, very cool. And yeah, we didn't get to exert influence over... Oh. We got more money now. We'll tax people more if we have more money. Which isn't necessarily a bad thing. Hopefully we take these guys out next. Oh, they're partially westernized now. But, at the same time... Oh, well. Nah, uh, that's not exactly bounce, but it's okay. Let's see. Can we throw any more guys here? Um, this is too many horses, realistically. So get two more engineers at the very least. Go three and go... Infantry and infantry. That should be good. And we need some of that. And we'll see who we'll go to war with next. Boxer atrocities in the Qing Empire. A group of Chinese nationalists known as the Boxers intent on driving out all Western influence of the Qing Empire have attacked a group of Spanish citizens. Several were slain while others were forced to flee for their lives. Worse, the Qing government has done nothing about it. They're looking for other ways while the atrocities are being committed upon their own people. That's not good. I love the war reps, but with the Saharan frontier. That's a two-two. The nomads of the Saharan Desert have always been too troubled with not enough benefits to keep under control. The great powers quickly settling out, setting out to carve Africa, establishing proper borders and proper control of even remote regions become a necessity. We can strike out a series of treaties to set up the Saharan frontier for territories and eliminate any possibility of border conflicts in the Sahara. Nice. Well, would you look at that? We just got bigger. Oh, wow. What happened here? Oh, the Ashanti. Okay, very nice. But Niger. Very cool. Anything else we do for economic mode? Born new empire? Can we actually... Oh! Scramble for Africa? Don't mind if we do. Uh, what do we have? Organized Niger? Yes, please. You don't say that word any other way. You totally don't. Uh, we'll come back... Yeah, actually, you know what? Let's go, go over here. Supplies? Not great, but not bad. I love how much Africa we have. And we're also down here to Dutch Equatorial. Oh. Dutch people. Hmm. So these armies are okay. They are not great. But if we do have to go to war with the Chinese... That would be not great, but not bad. Score is 50. Rank is 15. It's not terrible. Uh, we would need another group because this one's going to be fine down there. These guys are going to get eliminated pretty darn easily and quickly, which is not good. Uh, we need more money as well. We don't want to go to war with them. Going to war with them is probably bad. Here. Also, Germany did go to war with Hungary for this. Karatin? Croatia? Croatia? Crane? No. Something around here. But regardless. Oh, Germany's a... Wait. The fifth rest Russian restoration of order to the Baltic. Uh, you sure about that, guys? You sure, Russia? Um, I was justifying on Portugal, actually. As you can see, we were justifying on them. Um, okay. That should made this really ugly. Um, I do want to go to war with them. I'm not sure how fast we could take these guys out. We could try. Ah, uh, let's go. Let's save it anyways. We'll see what we can do. That's only 1893, so. Not sure how much really more of the campaign we're going to have here, but at the very least. So we can go to war with these guys. Put down the Boxer Rebellion. 12 wars before us trying to pay crimes to the Boxer Rebels. Um, the Confederate States will not accept, but the German Empire will. We could try it. We should do okay going in, but you never know. Also, let's make sure we're actually allies with these guys. Our dudes. Because our dudes matter. Cool. Spain. Oh, they don't like us. That's not good. Uh, they don't like us as well. And you don't really care for us either. Dang it. There we go. Nice. I mean, in theory. In theory. We should just be able to slaughter them all. Theory. Nice. Eh, that's over river. Don't do that. Sweet suffragette movement. Um. More upper liberal house. We'll see. 
We got hills, mountains. No, there's grassland. That's good. All right, we never got Captron. Just found Portugal. Very cool. Jilin. Yeah, both both of you guys go up there, and you guys go there too. We just need to kill off a lot of them as well. They're 49. We lowered the military score by one. We Spanish Alaska, which is very nice. I don't think there's any Spanish people that live up there just yet. The Confederates are still here, and they're considered a great power. Um, let's go to war with Portugal too before they get any more allies or any allies at all. I want them to make them a puppet as well. Should be able to do it by ourselves. Should, in theory. Should. Oh, wow. I forgot about this one. I'm glad we're not fighting for that piece of territory. Holy crap. Let's see what else we can do. Oh, hello. We probably won't get that one, but we'll see. We got three stages higher than you guys. Nice. Kikihar? Are you going to attack? Yeah, you are. You're actually really going to attack. Holy crap. Alright. So, development is nice. Shanti's gone. And you guys are pretty. That's fine. Whatever. Their attack efficiency is nice. Ooh, did I forget to do... No, they're still maxed out. That's nice. Oh, wow. Wow. It's a lot of dead. Faro? Hey, you're not too bad on attack. You're not great, but you're not bad. Over here, though. How are we doing? Got Habin. Wow. Not bad. I just want to puppet them and then, like, get war wraps and stuff, so. If at all possible. Sure. Nice. Good. Max speed, get some still steamers. Anything else? Ooh, Yugoslavia's getting taken out by the Germans, too. Yeah, we'll see what happens there. I hate fighting all these multiple wars at the same time, but we're we're doing we're doing fine. Cool. Go to Jilin. Oh crap, now we're fighting the British. Bro. What why? Well, Hmm. Accept, accept. Keep escalating it, Britain. We'll see what happens when you escalate it. I really don't want this war. Are you kidding me, bro? Oh, we could have gone to war with them as well, but, eh. Nikki? Actually, how much more do we need for China? Oh, actually, we have enough score for them. Portugal. There's not much they're going to be able to do once we take out all these guys, so. I mean, they can blockade us and stuff, but. That's literally it. China, oh China, oh China. Oh boy. This place could turn into World War One. You agree? Wait. The French War is Zanzibar. Fez.
Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Trying to gotta give it up, man. You're not doing so well. Now economically we're not doing great now, but whatever. I our soldiers. Conservatives, good. He's gonna attack in defense, and our guy's not good in defense at all. God dang it. That's fine. You guys can lose. Gee. McDonald, um. Well, close for now, it's fine. Is there any place here that has, like, mountains? Or really tough to fight in? Semi desert? Eh, not really there. Semi desert up there. A lot of deserts and such, which makes sense. It's sub it's not sub Saharan Africa, but it's loads S Saharan Africa up here, so. Maybe I'll go do this. There, it's fine. Alright. What other type of messes do we have here? Belgium, China, and Portugal. Education for women, and uh, there we go. Box protocol, nice. Enforcing submitted the foreign demand, signing treaty with the Spanish generals and representatives from all the great powers. The Righteous Harmony Society will be forced to be disbanded to the leaders executed in prison, and our government is once again humiliated. Nice. Good job, guys. Good job. So now I gotta deal with the British. To be honest, don't really want to. They're in a procedure in the world. Pretty nice. Pretty darn nice. Got a lot of railroads. British bunch of terrorists, it seems like, in this timeline. Alright, so be it. We just wanted them, but, you know, force our hand. Well, good, goes bankrupt. Yeah. Oh, what? You didn't give me time to respond to them. What the heck? What the heck? They land, like, a thousand soldiers as soon as we go there. Are you kidding me? What type of design is that? BS. I'm, I'm going to have to forcibly wipe piece them out. I'm taking Portugal whether they like it or not. That's a bunch of crap. So, um, yeah, I'm not going to deal with this with the British here or the Swedish, so I'm going to white piece them out. All right, everyone. So we white pieced out basically with the, uh, the British and the Portuguese. We didn't get them. The British got nothing. But now the, the French have actually gone to war with the Germans because the Germans just pieced out with the Russians. The Germans are not looking so strong now, too. But neither are the Russians. And the, the Balkans, well, I guess Yugoslavia is now has a couple balls. We've, uh, we've got the Ottoman Empire with us. So, other than that, the British really need to be taking down a, a huge notch. They are way too strong. Uh, what's going on down here? Oh, the Dutch. God, the Dutch. Jesus Christ. They are very, very annoying. The Dutch are very annoying, but the British are worse. No doubt about it. Are you going to attack at all? Eh, not really that much. So, of course, we do have... Actually, let's, before we even get going on. French Liberation of Elsa Um, We'll see what happens. Of course, it's us. It's, uh, it's the Republic of San Marco, Luxembourg, UBD, Iglesia de Dalmatia, Dalmatia, Bohemia, Moravia. Oh, Dalmatia... Dalmatia exists? Oh. German Dalmatia. That is very odd, but whatever. Oh, we lost a battle. Whatever. Weiska. Wow, the Germans are just spreading all over the place. Holy crap. Get in there. The mud attack. Oh, if you're worried about that, please go right ahead. The Liberal Party's rocked by Scandal. Outrageous. Nice. At this point in the campaign, you got to be extremely careful about defense. Um, because if it doesn't go very well, then, well, you're going to get screwed over pretty quickly. Can we get anything from them as well? I would like reparations. I like war reps. Reps are pretty nice. The goal is just to win as many battles and kill off as many French soldiers as possible, so... There you go. 
That's what we like to see. Baiting them in is always good. Attacking into here is probably a god awful idea, so we're not going to do that. We go to Bordeaux. Thank you, sir. Oops, wrong map mode. Thank you, thank you. Well, there's going to be a lot of battles going on. Um, we'll see what happens. Oh, good God, we'll definitely see what happens. Please don't attack there, you ding dongs. Ooh, we are kind of trapped now here. I want to help out here. But we have to go through these guys. Georges Bonaparte. Plus three attack, plus five. Bulgaria goes bankrupt. They better pay the god dang debts. What's going on down here? Losing the race in Congo. Well, we're out of points. Let them have it for now. I'm going to destroy the Dutch. We're going to have to destroy the Dutch. Uh, no. Not today. Ooh, that's not good. Japan, nope. I remember what you did to us, Japan. We're kind of hanging out. Uh, we're doing relatively okay. It's not great, but not bad. <clears throat> There's still a good chance for us to win here. Yes, I think. Japan on defense. Ooh, go down there. Nice, nice, nice. Ooh, not bad. Not bad if I do say so myself. Now this is not going well. Why is it going so poorly for us? Of course, we need more morale right now, but still. Are you sucking? You have no defense. God dang it. Nice. There you go. And this is a mainland army, so. We should do relatively okay ish. Oh, we peaced out. Already. White piece. Lots of white pieces. You've been really hammered down, which is not great, but you know what? We're here to talk about the Germans. The Germans are definitely not as strong as they used to be. Of course, this is HFM, so it's a little different, so. Um, other than that, I'm probably going to end the episode here because we're going to recuperate and try to make sure we do okay. We still have no infamy. We've got a lot of money now, now but it's probably just best. Yeah, hey, we spend some time and get ready for probably what will be very soon the first Great War. But if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you tomorrow, when we will probably end up in the first Great War. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.